On the last breakdown, we did a video of Ty Simpson from the 2022 A-Day. This is the most recent A-Day. Now, the film quality is not very good. I think there were technical difficulties that never ended. This was the best film I could get. Well, first down here, we start off. It looks like it probably is an RPO. You've got the stick wide open, uncovered, very fast release. One thing I like about Ty. Third down. Kind of throws into traffic here. You've got a linebacker over the top, you know, tight window. Next possession, first down. Good little easy pass, 12, 13 yards. Take what you can get. I think they ran it a few times, punted. So then third possession, a little read play. And you can see in a game, it looked like he might have got tagged. They let him run. I don't know what would have happened in the game. That was a tough angle. It was a good run. He's got some wheels. Uh, so now they're finally driving. A little pass underneath to the H-back. So far, a lot of simple, quick plays. But what I'm looking at, his release is quick. He's getting the ball out. He looks pretty decisive. Here he hesitates. I don't have the all 22 to see what he was looking at or what he was doing, but he comes back quickly, very fast release, quick trigger. Here he's got him, good read. He just overthrows Burton on this play. Uh, he seems to make quick, decisive reads. Most of the plays are shorter plays in this game, but again, that's a good ball placement. Again, not a big play, but... It's just a little out pass, and he puts it where it needs to be. Flip it around for the second quarter. Drops back, just a little pass over the middle. Again, nothing nothing big, but just getting the ball, moving it down the field. Next play, he steps up. And Burton does not separate much, but, man, he puts some zip on this throw right here. So that really shows off the arm. Uh, he puts it in a great spot, and he puts it on a line. Now he comes off his read. That ball should have been caught. Third and two, if the ball's caught, it's a first down. The drive continues. I like how he's just quick. He very quickly flips his hips, throws the ball fast to the next option. Here's a deep ball. and This ball is on the money, and this ball should have been caught. Uh, it's there, perfect throw. It's just not caught by the wide receiver. We come back, he comes off his first read, it's not there, throws it over the middle, he hits the guy, I think that's Burton here. Again, another great play. That's not his first read, he's able to come back and find the next receiver over the middle. Now the running back's wide open here, dumps it off and finds him. So they're putting together a good little drive. He's got time, lays it up. This ball is underthrown. You could argue it should have been caught, but I, I don't think that matters for this purpose. If he puts it, if he puts it in front of Burton, it's an easy touchdown, and the ball's not contested. And Ty, you can see he's he's quick. Next play, 54 seconds till halftime. Knowing the situation, he puts the ball right by the sidelines. Receiver just can't get the ball down in bounds. Good throw. Come back next play, takes a shot at the end zone. This is a great play by the DB. He could have led the receiver more, put a little air under it. Uh, the ball's really undercut, though. Great play. Uh, not the worst throw. Just a good play. Come back on third and goal. You know, he kind of fires one in there with a gunslinger mentality. The DB wasn't going to pick it, but he's not afraid to throw it into traffic. Wind up kicking a field goal. We see a little run play here. Third and nine. Receiver doesn't separate. Good play by the DB. Rolls out here. This is a great throw. Burton drops it. I mean, perfect throw on the run. Third and nine. Big hole. He doesn't have the speed Jalen has. Jalen probably gets that first down. Uh, Ties a little short. Second to seven, quick little pass here at the back. 
Towards the end of the third quarter here, rolls out. Again, ball probably should have been caught. It's a little high, but that ball should have been caught. Too many drops in this game from the skill players. Fourth down now. Good throw to Burton. I don't know if that ball was caught or not, but it was a good throw. You see, this is a downfield throw. This is a little overthrown. I don't blame Burton because he got smacked on that play. It was almost a great catch. And then here, a perfect throw to Burton. Just a perfect throw on the outside. Only a minute and a half. They're trying to score here. It's just a scrimmage. Ty, good escape ability here. That throw is a little low. Probably could have been caught. It wasn't a perfect pass. One thing I didn't mention is it was revealed after the game that he had an issue with his thumb. He was playing through. I don't know how much that impacted his performance. Uh, but it's very interesting to see how the summer plays out. It looks like all the quarterbacks are going to stay for the time being with Buckner coming in. I think Alabama has three legitimate candidates that could start this fall. Uh, we'll continue to break it down more, but let me know what you think in the comments.